so right now uh, there is a huge focus on newer technologies especially for someone who is coming from outside i would say any new technologies that you bring into the market especially anything to do with cloud is like very high demand in the market so if you have exposure to the newest and the latest technologies that you're working on um, it, it is like very very high demand in the market for permanent opportunities, what stand out for a candidate, especially in the IT sector, is how you present yourself in terms of your technology skills and your confidence. One thing that I, I do tell newcomers again and again is you know, practice and how you present your skills to the employer. So uh, having your skills and talking the talk about your skills is very important. So presenting yourself confidently about your skills, I think that's going to put you, um, the personality as a package, I think that's going to put you about the edge from the other candidates, if, if I can put it that way. I think the first, it's not just first three months, I would say, but it's your first job. So you have to get there and prove yourself, not not think it as a three month assignment, right? Canadian work culture demands you to be your work ethics, what you can contribute to the team, how you can bring your ideas forward. Not just be a headstone coder or just confined to your role and get get your role and you know move move from that, but what more you can offer. And I've I've seen people who can do that and contribute more than just just your part of the work, more headed career much quicker. So just don't see it as a three month, like see it as a, see it as a long term for you and try and bring whatever you can to the table. And uh, I can assure you, can you, employers here value that. Every conversation does not have to be a job conversation, but at least trying to connect with people and whichever opportunity that is, I would say take that opportunity, try to speak different people, different groups, you know, it could be professional network, it could be personal network, it could be network, um, you know, that relates to your culture, anything that you can. Try, try and put yourself out there connecting with different people and talking to different people, I think that's going to give you access to the better job opportunities in the market than the job, uh, the online portals. In the IT spectrum, um, communication plays a very important role. I know technical skills are important, but at the same time, if you're working in a permanent role, the first thing that stands out is your soft skill and how you communicate with people. Remember, you're working in a very diverse culture in the Canadian market. So employers here, 90% of the employers we work with do a phone interview first before they call you in for an in-person interview. One of the reasons for phone interview is to assess your communication skills, right? You, you can be accented, no problem in that. You know, everyone knows English is not your first language. It's not even my first language, but it's how you present yourself, how you speak yourself confidently, how is your pace when you speak to people, whether you are, you know, speaking at a very fast pace or slow pace, and how you can articulate your answers. I think that's more important than anything else.